Hello fellow Americans, I am the truth. In today's podcast, I will focus on the secret society Illuminati, of the enlightened ones, of those who see the light. To understand how this society influences the U.S. and world policy, we must understand their history, beliefs, and rituals. According to my research, uh, the modern day Illuminati started sometime around 1776 in Bavaria. Uh, in this day, the Roman Catholic Church ruled the masses with its doctrine. Uh, so these so called uh, humanist thinkers uh, rebelled and vowed to destroy the Roman Catholic Church, um, but more importantly, religion. Um, but ask yourself, why would a war like this even exist? Uh, now understand, I'm coming to you as an activist and a conspiracy researcher, even though Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior. Um, as these so-called uh, humanist thinkers, uh, Caluminati, were claimed to be men of science, teaching uh, the sun uh, or the light, henceforth the bearer of the light, uh, is the center of the universe and the earth revolves around the sun or the light. Uh, this secret society by the 19th century has spread throughout uh, Spain and France. Uh, by this time, secret societies were uh, spreading up all over. Uh, in Spain, uh, Caluminati were burned at the stake on Friday the 13th um, during the Catholic Inquisitions. Uh, by this time, um, it turned out just to be only a few. Uh, most fled, uh, blended in, and infiltrated uh, other secret societies, uh, such as the uh, Knight Templars or uh, the Freemasons, etc. Uh, they even infiltrated the uh, Catholic Church. Um, and again, I ask you, why would a war like this even exist? Uh, angels and demons, uh, dark and the light. Uh, as Caluminati set out for world domination to rule the masses, they realized they had to get rid of the existing world order, which was the law of God the Creator. This means uh, they had to control education, especially in the young, religion, for a good reason, and I'll explain that uh, later, and politics. Um, Americans, to unmask the truth, you must be able to see things in reverse. Uh, meaning you have to be able to think outside the box what you see what you hear what you read uh, sometimes you got to be able to uh, decode and, and, and really listen to the words and uh, I promise you you'll start to see that this new world order is of biblical proportions um, and these so-called uh, humanist thinkers Illuminati, accumulated great wealth through banking um, they took their religion uh, the rituals uh, and beliefs with them as they infiltrated uh, these other secret societies um, who have now become factions or fall under the same umbrella. Uh, their beliefs is actually a 6,000 year old religion um, that has been used and practiced in diverse, diverse cultures um, and has remained virtually unchanged and um, that is paganism, the worship of the sun god henceforth bearer of the light and the worship of the moon goddess. Uh, it doesn't matter what their names are. Uh, Isis and Osiris, uh, Apollo and Diana, Serenos and Aradia, uh, and a host of others. Paganism uh, emerged in ancient Babylon. Um, this ancient uh, religion is based on uh, the Kabbalah, which is an ancient witch witchcraft book uh, by the way, a lot of Hollywood and especially music industry celebs practice this religion. Um, for instance, Brooke Shields at Michael Jackson's funeral um, made a quote from a, a book uh, with no chapter, no verse, uh, and ending with, uh, I know you're sitting on your throne on the crescent moon. Um, I have no idea what it is or uh, what that means. But remember um, what I said earlier, be able to think outside the box, reverse, 
uh, what you see, what you hear, and sometimes what you read, um, and it'll become clear um, that um, it's a great possibility that our found, founding fathers built our nation with a secret agenda based on paganism. Um, but why? Why would they do that? I will explain that in part two of this pod podcast. Um, until then, think about what was the greatest trick played on man. Answer that and you will understand more about the so-called illuminated ones or those who see the light, the sun god, which equals the light, which equals the bearer of the light, which equals Lucifer. Until next time, America, God bless, wake up and unmask the truth.